go to sleep. Why are you mad at me? Because you, what has it done to the screen? It hasn't got the timer. No. So you, oh my gosh, what have you done to this camera? You, you're like, oh, I don't know how the microphone's wobbly. It's because like with the other video, when you were trying to loosen the bed by, what, what were you doing? You were trying to tighten it. The desk. Yeah, you were tightening tighty. it. Tighty, like, what was it someone said? Tighty, tighty, tighty lefty loosey. Ah. And you're like, I can't undo these screws as you were tightening them like past what they're supposed to be tightened to. And this one, you were unscrewing it and wondering why it wouldn't tighten. Yeah. Frankie. <laughs> is that your response? What is he doing? So um, we just did a little mini photo shoot with Frankie because I was sat on the bed and I was just like, I haven't posted on Instagram for a week and let's get a picture with Frankie because he's so cute. But um, we haven't vlogged all day today, have we? Bit dark. So dark You're outside. On, let me put it on the auto uh, ISO. Whoa, Alex, what are you doing? Auto. So we have Ah, see, now it has the timer back. No, it doesn't. Oh, it did. It's gone. So now we've not vlogged today because um, there's some business stuff happening behind the scenes, which I can't. Business stuff? Yeah. Business? Oh, uh, yeah. And house stuff. Ha house stuff we can kind of talk about. We're getting a little yeah. bit closer to completion and yeah. exchange. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So that we can mention, um, but there's business stuff that's happening as well. So I've I, I was just oh, tweeted yeah, about this. Right. I was like, what are you talking about? I'm, uh, no. <laughs> um, but I have just tweeted about this. I find it so difficult whenever I come home to Cornwall. It's like going home and back in time to when I was a child, and I just don't want to work. Mm. So um, on top of all those other things going on, which has occupied my whole day, I'm like kind of like, mm. but we're going to go to the shop now. So yeah. hopefully I can film a video tomorrow. Yes. Like a food video. Oh, like a proper food video. Yeah, maybe. Okay. But we'll gotcha. see. But we're going to go to the shops anyway because we want to get some food in. Yes. Um, and yeah, you look really weird. So I look ill? Yes. <laughs> I feel like we both look a bit ill. Yeah. I slept till 11. Yeah, also, I... we didn't go to bed till like 3. I cannot go to bed right now because I'm so excited about moving and I'm mm. so just in this like hyper mode that I just can't sleep. I just want to stay up till two, three in the morning, which is not likely, so is got, it? You got creeped out. You're watching creepy videos. Yeah, I watched a video that a girl uploaded about her um, experience where a guy like came over to her car and he was, um, she was fine, but she he was trying to sex traffic her. I'll leave the link to the video because all the comments in the video were like really creepy and also really important, I think, to look at and learn as someone, especially for women, to just be more aware of your safety. But I'll leave the link to the video because these things happen to people and something can change within a minute and you're in danger. So yeah, it's important to be aware. But that's a sidetrack. I watched that far too late at night and then I started getting scared. <laughs> I don't know why. Some, do you ever have that when you, something, you do something, what are you doing? <laughs> but you, you watch something late at night or you think of something late at night and it freaks you out more than it would do at daytime because you're tired. But um, anyway. And this guy was scratching to get in the door, wasn't he? Huh? He was scratching to get in the door. Yeah, and it was so creepy. Yeah. It sounded like a horror movie. Like, it was like proper creepy. It's like scratch, scratch. It was like a proper scratch. scratching noise. Oh, this is no, no good, this little thing. <sighs> Thank you. This is probably horrible to look at. Scratch that chin. What is that? A lens cap? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna go to Morrison's now I think. Oh that's Alex's cot. Is it? Oh. Look I've got a belly in this. It's because you have a belly in this. <laughs> I have a belly in this. <laughs> Do you want to come? You gonna get in the boot of the car? Sure. Right, I think Willow wants to come with us, Alex. Yeah. Yeah. Willow. Hey, Jane. Willow. See you later on. Bye. You're never in a jumping mood when I want you to be. Because she's sad that you're going without oh. her. So, who remembers shopping with Alex and Maddie? Oh gosh. 
from when we li lived in Cornwall. Does anyone has anyone been around for that long? It's so complicated to edit that. Are we doing that again? <laughs> no, but like maybe we maybe we can insert the old. Oh, you yeah. have the old clip. Oh, I've got it somewhere. It's we like need to insert that here because it was one of the was, oldest clips I've saved. On it was really hard drive. funny. Yeah. But we're going to Tesco to get some bits and we'll take you with us because I like shopping on vlogs. And I like yeah. watching people shop in vlogs. Yeah. It's been really lovely weather since we came back to Cornwall. It's literally been grey like this the entire been, time. It was so weird when I came off the dual carriageway yesterday to for like the final 15 minutes of the trip here. I came off like as soon as I crossed the white line off the road. <laughs> It was like someone had turned the shower on, like yeah, in look a, at it. like in a, you know, like in Friends or something. When they're outside, <laughs> and suddenly it starts raining. It's ridiculous. It's always like that here. Yeah, yeah like this more. is default Cornish weather. It's four o'clock. It's four o'clock, and, and it looks like the much. end of the world. Yeah. <laughs> I just had a moment where I realised that it's four p.m. and I haven't edited the vlog. So I usually do start editing the vlog at this time, or like three or four. We're about to go into town to go shopping. And then we'll have we'll come back and we we'll have dinner and stuff. I'm so not used to Alex. Don't do that. I'm so not used to um, vlogmas. Yet. Yeah. I'm like switched off from it. I didn't yeah. realise. I've like not. We've been sat around all day. I mean, we've been doing no, lots. Like we said, it has been. It's been a weird day. I've been, I've been sat down and like on my computer and on yeah. the phone and stuff. But like, it's one of those days where you're talking a lot and organising. Talking and yeah. And Alex and I haven't seen each other for a few days, so we've been talking about some business related stuff. Um, yeah. For a while. Okay, well we can mm, do it when we get back. Yesterday's vlog also didn't go up till like yeah. 11. I feel bad. But I think this one, I don't know what you filmed yesterday, but it was kind of Not just a lot. talking. Yeah. I think you just put it back to back, export it. Yeah, I'm, well, thinking, about get, I'm thinking about getting a haircut. I feel like my hair's getting to that length where it just looks a bit like thin. I don't know. I just feel like it doesn't have the fullness that it usually has up here. Yeah, I think I might cut it in the new year. Because I'd, I'd still be long, but I just kind of feel like it would be cooler like here rather than like long, long. I think you should get a fringe back, but cut it really short. No! Like all the cool kids do. It won't suit me because this thing will be put on show even more. <laughs> I wouldn't mind having a bit of a, uh, like a fringe, like a bit of a bang. I used to have like proper straight fringe. This camera really struggles with focus, you know? We need to see it. In low light, it does. It's terrible. Light. Can't even focus on the road. <laughs> there we go. Look at it. So I've turned the camera off and I realize this is, needs to be vlogged right now. Alex just said yesterday I had two lunches. And then what did you say? For breakfast, I had hummus and pita bread. No one says hummus. Hummus, it's spelled hummus, H-O-U-M-O-U-S. H-O? When? Since, it's spelled H-U. Yeah, it has two spellings, but H-U, I think it's stupid. Alex, it's spelled H-U, it's hummus. H-U-M-M-U-S. Yes. Stupid. H-U-M-M-U-S. It doesn't say that on the packaging. Are you joking? No. Since when did you say hummus? Hummus? Hummus. It's wrong, because hummus, H-U-M-U-S, is a thing in, like, soil. So when you say hummus, <laughs> it's just confusing. Who thinks it's hummus? And who thinks it's, who, who, what crazy people think it's hummus? But it's one of those, because it's like, I guess from a different language originally. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah, like, I'm probably totally wrong. It's like I? when people, like, when you go to an Indian restaurant, it says Papadom, and there's like five spellings. Well, depending on the Indian restaurant, you go to like Papadom, Papadom, yeah. Papadom. <laughs> or like what, the way that it's supposed to be like bruschetta, but you, I would never say bruschetta in a restaurant because I'd feel silly. I just say yeah. bruschetta. But I've done I've done that where I, I know it's bruschetta. Yeah. And then I said I'll have a bruschetta, and the waiter said one bruschetta. And I was like, ah. Yeah. No. I have Isn't said that it. a weird phenomenon when um, you say things, you know the correct way, like moe is supposed to be moet, like in it's moet. Well, that's one because it's it's only moet because it's moet a chandon. Yeah. So I assume moe is a name, but because of the word after moe, mm. it's moet. But I think where it's from, they would, in, it's French, right? French. So it's, they would say Moet. Yeah. Well, I thought, but everyone says Moet I, and you would feel like an idiot to say Moet. But I thought you said Moet normally. I could actually be completely wrong. But there are things like that, aren't there? There's like, I feel like there's a phenomenon of people, like English people, like, um, where you say things the way 
that you should the English people say it because you feel embarrassed to say it the proper way. Uh, like chorizo. Chorizo. But I'm pretty sure it's, it's Spanish. Chorizo. So it should be chorizo or something chorizo. like that. Chorizo. Yeah. Chorizo. Like the the. Um, if you said that, no one would know what you the meant. The th sounding sounds. The. Azul. <laughs> there must be so many other examples of that in food, especially. Yeah, food. But yeah, interesting. Who says hummus? In write a comment. Do you say hummus with a U, or like me, or do you say hummus like Alex? Well, it, and technically, it, it's hummus. And because hummus, right, is from like various different places. Is there an actual specific place it comes from, or is Originator. it from various? Like, is it because I know it's like Middle Eastern Greek. Yeah. Is there a, sp or do people argue about where it's specifically from? Probably. But if you are I mean, who, from- Who was the first person to take chickpea yeah, and push yeah. it up? Yeah, like, and if you are from there, if you are from a place where hummus <laughs> is your traditional dish, how do you pronounce it? Yeah, I'd be interested to know that. Yes, because yeah. maybe, I feel, I have a like a weird, uh, 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 I have a bad feeling that I'm wrong. I thought hummus. And I have a bad feeling that Alex Actually, is right and it's hummus. I thought I, I see a lot of Americans. Hold say on. Hummus. hummus. How do I say it? I say hummus. You say hummus. Okay, no, it's hummus. Hummus. I mean, I probably would say hummus. You would say what? hummus. Hummus. I say, I I've say never like heard you. Hummus. <laughs> okay, not, we need to kill this conversation. <laughs> We've gone three minutes of this conversation. <laughs> we need a trolley. Dead ass. Oh, what about this one? It's got a nice banana though with it. Oh my gosh. Look at the size of that. Why are they so big? We ne I don't remember the last time we bought avocados. I hate when they say ripe and ready and they are absolutely not ripe nor ready this way let's just go round periodically Periodic. not periodically systematically peppers i used the peppers up so i think peppers would be nice lime where do we get the tacos <laughs> my mum says tacos not tacos it's really funny do you want any bananas look we're both wrapping the jumpers both of us have literally worn them ever since we yeah. got so them soft. they're so soft this, I've got this t-shirt on and I've got the eat, uh, this jumper on and the eat happy t-shirt on underneath. Uh, Everyone's looking at me because I'm vlogging. I love it when the bunches are gigantic. Yeah. Like seven. That's enough. Seven. Don't get any more. Yeah. Lettuce. Oh. That was a miss. Did she say she needed it? Yes. What, what else do we need? Chili garlic. So some what? Chili garlic. No, what, what's this right here? Humus. Huh? Humus. So you just said it wrong. Hummus. Ooh. Hummus. Hummus. <laughs> two for two. Do they have cool flavours? Jalapeno. Or yeah, do they have peri a normal, normal one's nice. Do they, do, do they have a piri piri? That's always oh, my favourite. Nice. Garlic? Smell this. It's so cool. It smells like bar barbecue. <laughs> like bonfire. Oh, they've got their own range. Cool. Paella. That's cool. Three bean chili. I did not know they had this. Sorry. Lentil hot pot. Mm. That sounds nice. That's cool. These? No, these aren't. It's my dad's birthday tomorrow, and it's a BYOB place we're going to, and so we're picking up some alcohol. None for me though. This is the good aisle. That's what we came here for. Ooh. That's my favourite then. What favourite? Wasabi. Well, please just don't buy that anymore because it's horrible. My absolute pain. Sea salt and black pepper, yum. We really want some pickles. I think they've got pickles. So we think the donuts are vegan. Yeah. Yeah. <gasps> oh, wow. Raspberry flavour. Oh, these strawberry as well. They're the same. What about these ones? Ice donuts. Let's check. No. So this is the hack. When you go into a supermarket and you look at like the fresh goods, they'll always have contains and then they'll have allergens. They'll have like milk, wheat, soya, eggs, that type of thing. So you can always see if things are vegan. And often donuts 
at supermarkets are vegan co-op are vegan yep. donuts and I think yeah. these ones are they too. used to do like a salted caramel one but they don't have it here mm. are we gonna get both of course they also only have one type of vegan cheese they need to up the game with the vegan cheese don't they yeah so we're gonna have to try and grate this onto our <laughs> onto our thingies but I know what I'm getting Let's go explore the frozen bit. We've got loads of new things. So look, I've got all these new vegan sausages, vegan quarter pounders, fries. If you want to try in a really legit fake chicken, this stuff tastes exactly the same as normal chicken nuggets. And so do these schnitzels. They just taste like chicken nuggets. They're so good. We bought these the other day, but my dad had them. They, I tasted them, they tasted nice. This looks like a great shopping basket full of health. The health at the bottom. We got it at the start. I think we are done here. We didn't unpack the car, so I'm having to put this in my lap. Didn't think that one through, did we? I did, but I thought it'd be oh, funny. Oh Where are the other bits gonna go? Ah. What? No, you can't put those in here. There's nothing to can't go. I put them on there. No. No, 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 no. You got no, two hands. Can you put them somewhere else? Well, hold them there for now and I can find a place. At least I'll have easy access to the donuts. Is there anyone else? Every single time I go to the supermarket and I buy any cheese, I always eat it on the way out. I don't know if that's weird because I because we got that Via Life sliced cheese. I always have a slice and I like fold it up and eat it because it's just so good. All we've eaten today, literally all day, is a smoothie that we shared. That never happens. At least you had Twiglets. I had a handful of Twiglets. But that never happens because I'm a very hungry person. <laughs> because of the stress of everything, I just didn't have an appetite and I just got distracted. But I'm gonna have to have a donut right now. Should we just eat a donut before we go? Yes, please. Okay. Oh, they're huge. They are legit. Let's put this light on. They're very. Look at these donuts. They're like so oh my God. sugary. They're better than the co op ones. Way better. Mm. Can you eat the whole one without licking your lips? No. These are definitely vegan, right? Oh yeah, I can't do it. Mm. Mm. There's not as much jam. They confirmed it on the um, Morrison's customer service people. The dough is better, but they need more jam inside. About 10p for a vegan donut. Bourbons. We've got loads of beer and alcohol for you. Beer and alcohol? Beer and wine. Loads of reduced bread. Bread, 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 mm. bread, bread. Spent a bloody fortune. Oh, what else have we got in here then? We've got some Indian beer for the... Yeah, we've got beer for the beer. curry. Crips. Oh, yeah. Crips. Mm. you got them. Marshmallows, these are great. I want to make a hot chocolate later. Chilies, I love the size of those chilies. Got this, these things you saw, veggie deli. The best Pringles. These are pretty great. <laughs> Can't have any. Candy kittens. Marinated tofu. More candy kittens. Candy kittens. Katsu. Hot chocolate. Chocolate for later. That's and all the rest is the kind of boring stuff. Bye. See you tomorrow. Hurry, hurry. Mama's looking worried. Will the pie be ready in time? Papa's out getting a treat.